This is the fast attack ballistic missile submarine Kraken. Now this isn't the first time I've used this name, but it is the first time I've used it in a conventional submarine. Although it's not very conventional. It is a whole block submarine. And as you can see, it launches subsurface to surface ballistic missiles from underwater. But there's more than that, but I'll just give you this to watch for now. So this submarine is a bit of a multi-role, able to take out land targets, shoreline targets, and other naval targets, and occasionally even air targets. As you can see, it has a torpedo that when it hits the surface of the water, accelerates violently due to the thrusters, but that also works as an underwater torpedo, and those deceptively hard to intercept ballistic missiles. It's because of the flight path and trajectory. They fall really fast, really hard. When they're coming in, there's not really much you can do about them. I've only, I don't think I've actually ever seen those get intercepted. Which is kind of funny to say, considering they're lost with the submarine and they're relatively short range. But uh, very effective, they are AP, and there's two of them. So if one misses, the second one should guarantee the shot. You just gotta point and shoot within its relative range. And here I'll be showing what the underwater mode of the torpedo can do to a ship. Although for some reason it's upside down, but whatever. Yeah, it's proxy as well. So it gives it a lot more versatility than a normal torpedo. Uh, there's another clip using it against a subsurface target. <laughs> there was a missile just launched at me there. Just stopped, went a little bit past. Whole block armor, very, very durable. So as you can see, the submarine is coming down in front and torpedo. Now I want to show you something that sets it apart from many other subs. That's its ability to attack land targets. Yeah, that's right. I just launched a torpedo at a shoreline target. Why the hell would I do that? But what if I told you that torpedo can actually beach itself on the land and yeah, do that to a heavily armored tank. And of course, you guessed it, fire ballistic missiles at land targets at target with reliable accuracy. Now, they have to be fired from underwater to be accurate, but as you can see, yeah, I, I just nailed that guy. It would have nailed him twice if he didn't get launched away. Uh, this is one of the more obscure abilities that they can do. Uh, right now, I'm getting rid of the front payload to you know, just kind of reduce the chance of getting detonated. Because they do sit behind the seat, which is a little scary. So you do have to keep that in mind. But uh, that's a helicopter. Remember when I said the torpedo also has proxy on it? Watch this. And that's a dead helicopter. Here I'll be showing off the torpedoes against a very heavily armored and shielded battleship made by Astronomic and Proxy. And <laughs> the ship is in orbit. Okay. Wow. That is ridiculous. Now I'm using ballistic missiles against ships. This isn't really their intended use. They can be used against ships. You got to be very accurate though. The range is about 408 meters on the surface of the water. They're probably just going to punch a hole through the deck of a very heavily armored ship. But hey, you never know. You might take out the seat. And this is just me messing around, going against another submarine. Uh, Trimere Graph, they're a very skilled user. Just fired a torpedo, but that shit is off. So, you know what? Time for the guns. And I think he had some explosives on him, so yeah, he, he blew up. Classic sub warfare right there. Be sure to like and subscribe if you would like to see more. Thanks.